An electron experiences an upward force of 2.8 times 10 to the minus 12 newtons when it is moving at a speed of 5.1 times 10 to the 6 meters per second towards the north. What is the direction and magnitude of the magnetic field? First thing you notice, we have two significant figures here, so our answer will have two significant figures. And it's a little different the way we're talking about up and north. Typically you think up is north, that's what we've always showed on a page, it's towards the top of the page. But what we do here is we're going to use a regular compass. So north would be in this direction. And of course, east is here. So let's just do that. East, then you have south here, and west here. Now, we have the velocity moving towards the north of this electron, and the upward force. So upward in this case is out of the board, OK? So that's a little different from what we've done before. So here's our our geometry of what's going on here. Now we want to find, let's find the direction of the magnitude, excuse me, the direction of the magnetic field first. The force is coming out of the board and let's pretend this is a proton for a second because remember we just reverse everything if it's a negative charge. So if it's a proton the force is coming out of the board so I point my right hand thumb towards me, right towards my face. The velocity is up so I have my four fingers pointing up so I've got my hand with my thumb pointing at my face, my four fingers going up. To find the magnetic field, I have to know which way my fingers would curl to point towards it. So in this case, my fingers curl only to the left, towards the west. Be pretty hard to bend your fingers the other way. So if this were a positive charge, the direction of the magnetic field would be to the west. But since it's an electron, the direction of the magnetic field that gives you that force would be to the east. So now let's do the easy part, the algebra. And yep, there we go, we're to the east. If this were a proton, the magnetic field would be in the opposite direction. We use F equals QVB perpendicular. We're solving for the magnetic field, so we divide both sides by QV. We substitute in the numbers. And here's the charge in a proton, 1.6 times 10 to the min minus 19th coulombs. You'll always be given that. You don't have to memorize it. And then we come up with the answer, which is 3.43 Tesla. And remember I made a big thing about sig figs in the beginning? This is wrong. That shouldn't be there. It should just be 3.4 Tesla towards the east.